second breakfast in Japan. <laughs> Got onigiri, some sakana, sakana. <laughs> miso, and gohan. This is Tomomi. <laughs> She's super cute and awesome. <laughs> what? <laughs> And then this is what it looks like. It's so nice. This is the nicest buffet I've ever been to in my entire life. I don't feel like I don't belong here. I don't deserve to be here. <laughs> All right, so we just finished orientation today. And now we're going with our senpai, who is a person that's been here at this school way longer than we have. And they're going to take us to the cafeteria. And we'll have our first meal in the cafeteria. So this is this cookbook, recipes of Japanese cooking, and we go to the beginning, and one of the first things is how to prepare boiled rice, and it gives us this lovely informational section that goes like this: Rice never bores the Jap. <laughs> rice never bores the Japanese, and represents an indispensable staple of the Japanese diet. This section introduces you to the best way in which to prepare tasty boiled rice. Knowledge is power. <laughs> <laughs> Moving into our dorms, we're taking a tour of Matsudo. <laughs> I'll put the title right here. Um, this is the area where our dorm is located, and there's tons of cool stuff. There's like department stores and Burger King and cool stuff. This is Kat. Kate. Kate. <laughs> this is Kate. <laughs> Hello. Yes. my group I got some random stuff at a Hyakuen store which is basically a one dollar store so I thought hey why not show it in my vlog because maybe some people are curious as to what you can find at a basically one dollar store in Japan so first off we have this this is a plastic bag with like a mesh underneath and I thought it would be good to use as like a shower bag to bring my stuff to the shower this is the same thing, but it's pink and has like stars and stuff, and it's it's pretty kawaii. <laughs> this bottle of water, because all of the cups in the restaurants are so tiny, and I feel dehydrated, so I just need to chug this water and just keep this bottle and just drink this thing. I don't know. It's 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 water. It's hydration. Next is this thingy. I'm gonna use like attach it to my purse and like stick it on the inside so my I have my metro pass so I can just like fling out of my purse and scan it and it just seemed important and it's pink and it says oh oh pasu kesu pass case pass case we got this thing right here that I think is supposed to prevent blisters it looked interesting so I thought I'd just try it out. It looks like fingerless gloves for your feet. If you're if you want to make your foot look like it's going through 2006 through its emo phase, except it's not black. Anyways, we have these little uh, these little heart shaped things. It just looked cute, so I felt like buying it. Got a coin purse because cash is very very much used here. Um, I probably am not ever going to use my debit card unless I'm going to ATM. And the coins here are also used very frequently. Like there's like a 500 yen coin, which is basically a $5 coin. Give or take currency, value of exchange, blah, blah, blah. And then finally we have this little keychain <laughs> wrist thingy. I have no idea, but it was cute. So I had to get it. There's a bell. So yeah, so those are some of the things you can buy at a Hyakuen store. $1 store in Japan, you can probably find, I'm probably going to be going back there for other 
stuff that I probably don't need, but it's only a dollar and it's cute, so I figure I need it. Cause yeah, but anyways, second full day of Japan is now over. I can't believe it's only a second day. It feels like I've been here for so long. Um, I've been trying to say more Japanese words, but still feels really awkward saying it, but yeah, I gotta just do it anyway. I feel like it's gonna be, I feel like it's gonna be a while until I can grasp this language. Like, I don't know, but we'll, we'll keep trying. So anyways, this concludes the vlog. Thanks for watching. Tomorrow is going to be us going back to the campus. Tomorrow's Saturday and we're going to do more orientation stuff. And then Sunday we have the com whole day off, complete day off. So I don't know what we're going to do, but anyways, made it this far. So thanks for watching and stay tuned for more vlogs in Japan with my semester abroad. Yeah. Woo! Okay. Okay. Bye. <laughs>